Exodus chapter 6 verses 2 and 3 and God spake unto Moses and said unto him I am the Lord and I appeared unto Abraham unto Isaac and unto Jacob by the name of God Almighty but by my name Jehovah was I not known to them good morning sunshine we are great and we're also extraordinary and excellent in Christ Jesus the Lord God of the Hebrews and heritage 12 tribes of Israel Israel's sons Reuben thou art my firstborn my might and the beginning of my strength the excellency of dignity and the excellency of power Simeon Levi Judah Zebulun Issachar Dan Gad Asher Joseph the archers have sorely grieved him and shot at him and hated him but his bow abode in strength and the arms of his hands were made strong by the hands of the mighty God of Jacob. From thence is the shepherd, the stone of Israel, Naphtali, and Benjamin. We will read in scripture Exodus chapter 3 verses 14 and 15 it is written and God said unto Moses I am that I am and he said thus shall thou say unto the children of Israel I am has sent me unto you and God said moreover unto Moses thus shall thou say unto the children of Israel the Lord God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob, has sent me unto you. This is my name forever, and this is my memorial unto all generations. Exodus chapter 6 verse 4. It is written, and I have also established my covenant with them to give them the land of Cana, the land of their pilgrimage, wherein they were strangers. Exodus chapter 6 verse 7 And I will take you to me for a people, and I will be to you a God. And ye shall know that I am the Lord your God, which bringeth you out from under the burdens of the Egyptians. The Lion of Judah, give your life to Jesus while you still have an opportunity in your life. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost it is a promise to all those generations that call on the name of the Lord Jacob Israel he kept him as the apple of his eye Deuteronomy chapter 32 Verse 10, it is written, He found him in a desert land, and in the waste 
howling wilderness. He led him about, he instructed him, he kept him as the apple of his eye. You have a blessed day.